Teacher salaries are still on the table in Bay County as the teachers union and district leaders continue to hash out their differences. Both parties met to negotiate teacher contracts and talk about pay raises again tonight. News 13's Chelsea Tadonio was there. After months of negotiating teacher contracts, Bay District Schools and the Association of Bay County Educators Teachers Union are back at the negotiating table. On the agenda, teacher salaries. What they proposed was uh, $5 million a year uh, in a two-year package plus a cost of living increase. So that's uh, almost double what, uh, what has been done in the past. So that's a pretty significant request on their part. Um, we love our teachers. Uh, they certainly deserve a pay raise. Um, but this is a, a very tight budget year. Our overall budget increased 47 cents a student. $5 million would be divided between all teachers each year. So we've done our research and we tore their budget apart and we believe we, that we can show them they have the money to give us this. And if they really want to recruit and retain highly qualified teachers in Bay County, they'll pay us like they, we want to be paid. The district will bring the request to the school board. While the money is still being negotiated, two agreements were made, cutting back on the time teachers spend in their professional learning communities and planning periods, allowing them more time to spend with students. And teachers will be able to use their one paid bereavement day for the death of a sibling. Until now, paid bereavement was only allowed for parents, spouses, and children. In Panama City, Chelsea Tadonio, News 13. Both Bay District Schools and the Teachers Union will meet again on October 3rd to continue negotiating teacher salaries. In a Bay County courtroom, trial is underway.